you're a regular player out here at Caramar Golf Course, you'll know that there's not a lot of flat lies, and more often than not, we're playing shots with the balls either above or below our feet. Now, I'm out here on the 12th hole, and it's probably one of the most severe sloping fairways on the golf course. I've got 120 meters in, so I'm gonna hit a smooth pitching wedge into this green, but we can see here that the ball is quite significantly above my feet. Now, one of the things that we need to remember is that when the ball's above my feet, that ball wants to start a little bit more left of my intended start line, and especially when I've got more loft in my hand, that ball is going to want to start even more left. And it's the opposite if that ball's below our feet, we're going to aim, or that ball's going to want to start a little bit more right. So we need to account for that by changing where we set up and where we aim to. So the flag here today is on the right hand side of the green, so it's not really going to be a flag that I'm going to attack. But it's definitely something that I can line up to, knowing that this ball's going to start a little bit left, and hopefully finish in the middle of my green and not have too difficult a putt coming in. So rather than aiming at the, fly, uh, at the middle of the green, we're going to adjust our alignment, aiming a little bit more at the flag. And we're not going to do anything too differently here. So I don't want you to adjust your pressure. I don't want you to try and swing any flatter or any more upright. Just make a natural swing, knowing that the pressure and the lie is going to change your swing plane and where everything's moving. Our focus is still out on that target. So we're aiming at the flag putting a nice smooth swing on it and hopefully have this finish towards the middle of the green. So you can see that ball started a little bit left of the flag and it's finished there in the middle of the green. Give this one a whirl. It is a shot that a lot of golfers struggle with, but I think it's because we overcomplicate the process of playing a shot where the ball's either above or below our feet. If you've got any questions, pop them in the comments below. More than happy to answer your questions, and we'll catch you next time.